So they're constantly in a cycle of elation and depletion. Unlike the grandiose narcissist who has a ready supply, so they're on a fairly continuous steady burn of elation, the fragile or vulnerable narcissist is failing all the time to get that supply. He gets it, he loses it. She wins it, she loses it again. So they cycle between elation and depletion. So therefore, they're more moody, generally speaking, than the grandiose narcissist, but also you'll see them cry. You'll see them fragile. You'll see them vulnerable. They will say sorry. They will apologize. But ultimately, they're only cycling as they're trying to get back up to a position of power because everything that this personality disorder is about is all about power over others. 